So let's say there's a fire in your house, God forbid, and your body is not going to say, okay, let me take a few more minutes and digest the food that I've eaten uh, this morning. Let me take out all the proteins and the vitamins and put them in the right places. Or your body's not going to say, okay, let me uh, quickly digest the food so I can go to the bathroom before I leave the house because there's fire in the house. That's not what your body's going to do. And also it's not going to say, okay, you know what, let's take a little bit of oxygen that I have and a little bit of the sugar that I ate uh, this morning. I'll break it down and give it to my hair so my hair looks beautiful when I go out and people will see me. That's definitely not what your body is doing. Your body is going to take all the oxygen, everything it can, and give it, um, it'll break down all the sugar it has stored uh, to give you that quick boost of energy so that you can run out of the house. Right, so all your body's um, oxygen and everything is taken to the place where it's supposed to be so that you can survive. So your hair and nails are really compromised on that because instead of the growth phase, your blood supply is gonna stop. So hair will quickly go into the rest phase. The rest phase lasts for about three months. So that's when you will start seeing shedding of hair three months after something significant happen in your life. Also, post-pregnancy is a time when you see lots of hair fall because during pregnancy your hair is at growth phase everything is at growth phase in a sense when you're pregnant you know you're getting a really good healthy supply of oxygen to your hair and your hair is looking usually looks really luscious and beautiful and you have very little shedding of your hair because your hair stays longer in the growth phase when you're pregnant so right after you deliver uh, you don't need all of that stuff. So a lot of the hair transitions to the rest phase uh, or in the previous video I said about 80 to 90% is that growth phase. In pregnancy it's longer and for the longest duration a lot of your hair stays in the active growth phase. So when you are done with pregnancy and you have your baby then you typically lose a lot of that extra hair that was there. A lot of people, because you don't notice so much hair fall during pregnancy, after pregnancy when you see it, you feel like you're losing a lot of hair. Sometimes it's not too much extra hair than usual. Maybe sometimes it is, but it's usually a natural way. You lose hair, but then that usually stops. Um, it's not permanent. Mm -hmm. 